Hello everyone, we're back from our Final Fantasy VII. So we disabled the uh, security, or the security was disabled on us. Uh, not really exactly sure which, but we've got a key card now, and we got a uh, new punch gloves for Tifa. Uh, let's check out this door. Let's see, it looks like we can go this way, we can go back that other way, and through the central door too. Um, the door's open in for us. There's a gate over here. What about the other side? Uh, looks like that's the exhibition hall. This way is the elevator hall, which is the way we're gonna go. And this is the evacuation route. So let's check out the ways that aren't the central way, because... You have got to be shitting me. Nope. We're a lot less likely oh. to get caught this way. But a lot more likely to die of boredom. Okay, so this is the stairs route. <laughs> Dare you run up the stairs? It's only 59 floors. Nothing to it. Well, at least it ain't a race. Small blessing. Does that mean I chose this option? Or can I go back? I like this music now. Very nice. Because I do want to see the exhibition hall still. Okay, we got the cars. Uh, looks like that's about it on this side. Oh, there's a chest. An Iron Maiden, huh? Ah, it's a it's a bangle. Um, an elegant yet macabre bangle inspired by an ancient instrument of horror. Forgoes materia in favor of optimizing physical defense. So does that mean it's got zero material slots? Because if so, that's that's not what I want. Oh yeah, zero slots. That is a lot of defense though, wow. Um, well, probably not gonna put that in right now because I'm uh, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of obsessed with leveling material, so uh, a zero slot, zero slot angle is not what I want. Now, if I go through the elevator area, are they gonna just do that, like, dialogue, or am I, like, locked into the... Locked into the stairs path? Hmm. You know what? I joked about the stairs, so I'm gonna take the stairs. Now, I will say... Uh, it's extremely likely that nothing's gonna be happening or nothing's gonna be interesting while I'm running up these Wonder stairs. Like up there. Uh, although there's probably gonna be a dialogue. Um, We're gonna be exhausted by the time we finally get I will to say, top. all I have to do is basically hold forward on the stick, on one stick, and hold turn break. on the other one. Come on, Barry. And, uh... I'm basically doing nothing right now. I don't even have to like change where my fingers are. You can stop if you want. Because <laughs> I'm doing a circle. Um, but yeah, if any, I might, I might just edit this out. Uh, I might leave it in depending on if anything interesting actually happens. Oh, cloud is slowing down now. What do you like how they're talking? I kind of want to take this route because I was curious to see if there would be any like materia on the way or uh, elixir. But, we'll see. It might just mean me popping back after we get to the 49th floor and saying, hey, nothing happened. Guess these labs and shit are all the way at the very top. Yep, the very top. I like how he says that exasperated. That's it's good voice and vocal work. Good to know. Copy. What was that? I don't think I heard you. Speak up. I'll keep an eye on Barrett. Diva booked it. <laughs> oh, thanks for the assist. <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> oh, you're sounding better. <laughs> I think I've got like a stair climber's high. <laughs> Glad 
I think uh, I, I paused for a little bit to let Barrett catch up, and uh, then as soon as they started moving, we just passed him again. I think Tifa's like 10 fours above us, though. Oh, she is. She's waiting. You tired? I was. Oh, I just noticed over there by the health, so my microphone is actually in the way. It shows what floors they're on. Uh, when I go back for the editing, I'm gonna have to keep uh, keep what track and see for? how far ahead of us she was. She's so much faster. You really are doing better. And actually, I can't even. Not only can I not run anymore, but I can't even. Um, he's not even jogging. He's just at a walking pace now. Even if I hold the run button. Hard to argue with that. Space and aeronautics. Barrett, pass me up. Barrett moves faster now. I can no longer run. But tell me, these stairs, are these stairs ever gonna end? <sighs> I don't think the stairs are talking. Well, duh. Um. Duh. I was joking. That's enough from both of you. 50th floor, public security. Yep. And you're in no state to fight anyway. I've actually done a similar stair climb. Um. I don't remember where it was. Uh, what should I do? I want to say it was in is in Atlanta or Indianapolis. I can't remember which. I was at a convention, Shut and there's this really interesting building that had a, just like a crazy high stair climb that me and a few friends did. Oh wow, clouds moving even slower now. Yeah, this is as fast as I can move. I can, no run. He's at a, a slow walk. That's actually that's actually interesting that they make you. Like they speed limit you. This sucks. I want to go back. <laughs> We're almost there, Barrett. It's all about cutting those corners. Gotta take the inside curve. Another day, another struggle. Climbing stairs, so much trouble. <laughs> I love how he's singing. I made it. And there wasn't even an elixir for my troubles. something for our troubles. There may have been and I actually didn't, just didn't even notice it. Made it. The real challenge starts now. Okay, let's go. B-13, Materia Research Facility. 70, 80, 90, 100%, 110. Mako supersaturation confirmed. <laughs> Engaging materia cooling. <laughs> she uses the soldiers as like a footrest. Oh, hey, they, they turned red. Madame Director, you have a meeting shortly. Stop. Your timing is impeccably atrocious. 
Mako density and materia integrity are both holding steady. Registering mass increase in core materia. Interesting. Did the camera go up because of the experiment? Or no. what happened there? Show me something truly exquisite. Oh, uh, that's contaminants registered. We're leaving. Materia growth accelerating, outpacing models, registering crystallization within the reserve tanks. The reaction is oh. out of control. We have to stop it quickly. Clean up the mess, would you? Damn. Maybe I guess crawling after her. Jesus. So this is the Skyview Hall, huh? Bet this place cost a fortune and then some. Let's look for reception. So in the original, there's actually people around in this hey, area, like on lunch break check and it out. stuff like that, and you had to get a, a materia. Or not a, get a, you got, well you do get some materia, you also um, would have to get key cards for each floor as they go up. So there wasn't like a master key card, there was like a key card for floor 60, a key card for floor 61, etc. Want to come here at night to take in the view. So pretty and marvelous and beautiful. But every little light burning bright runs off her blood. And bit by bit they bleed her, never stopping to think how it'll end for them. <sighs> yeah. Terrible, but beautiful all the same. Mm, true. I like how I inadvertently have a green material in the green little circle on the sword. If I were to switch the material around, would the green, uh, would the blue one be there? I like this kind of classical, kind of jazzy song. An authorized keycard is, re is required. Oh, it's like a virtual you must be receptionist. Here for our grand tour. Visitors have access to floors 60, 61, 62 as well as floor 63. You will proceed in that order. By the exit of each floor, you will find a device that will allow you to update the key card in your possession. Interesting. Thereby allowing you to access the next floor. And now begins your grand tour. Please enjoy the Shinra experience. Why is this whole thing gotta be such a <laughs> big pain in the ass? I don't know about you, but this is kind of weird. Not how it worked in the original. Well. But... Yeah, I do. Think this is a trap? <laughs> if it I mean, they'd have to see him on the cameras, even if like, some people weren't paying stuff. attention. There's no way they don't know we're here. Although technically, that's the whole point of the uh, using the um, stairs is that they weren't supposed to know. Man, well, we gotta get all these damn key cards just to get anywhere. This is Shinra HQ. The how did you expect? Says the former company stop. man himself. Guess you'd know about all the rules, regulations, and red tape. It's like coming home, huh? I want to look around and see if I, uh... I like how there's kind of just people chilling. I feel like there should be a little bit more. Um... Just because, you know, it's a huge company with... Like, 70-some floors. Uh, if this is kind of like the, the break area... There would be a lot more. I wonder what that large blank area is for. They're not saying I know that much. There's that elevator. That's the elevator section. The middle one, and then there's these these ele elevators that go to the higher floors. I wonder if they're gonna still have the crawling through the ducts um, storage yes. warehouse every like puzzle reactor, area. Every pillar. 
like I said, Marie was on the a full third inspection. Floor, which is urban. There's no telling what kind of damage there might be. If you see anything, anything out of the ordinary, I want to know. Reeves looked kind of a good guy. <sighs> Sorry to bother you, sir. No, it's fine. I've brought the damage assessment for Sector 7 you requested. Sir, perhaps you should try and get some sleep. Yeah, he's clearly upset no, about not everything. Yet. I need to finish preparing my draft of the reconstruction plan before tonight's board meeting. <sighs> Whatever reasons they might have had, destroying an entire sector is... It's beyond the pale. Director. Yeah? I would strongly advise you not to say such things outside of this room. Yeah, I was like, is she supposed to know about that? Don't I know it. I'm guessing she just does, but... He probably is, does not have authorization to let anyone know that it was a planned thing. Oh yeah, the, the gang was just on that camera right there. Sixtieth floor of the Memorial Museum. I'm trying to remember what each floor was in in the actual game. Uh, there was one that was kind of like the storage warehouse that you had to crawl through the docks. There was the one where you had to recreate the, um, the diorama. There was the boardroom where you went into the bathroom and crawled up to see the meeting. That's creepy. Welcome to the Shinra Building, our humble home. Oh, hell no! Here in the Memorial Museum, you can learn all about our president, as well as the various divisions that make up the company. And of course, yeah, he's clearly not full of himself. The miracle of Mako Energy. Whatever takes your fancy, you're sure to learn something new. Yeah, yeah, shut up. Barrett hates it so much. Understandably so. Uh, okay. The president. I I, I he's got a golden gun. Man thinks very highly of himself. Yeah, he's pretty full of himself. Little information kiosks right there. I wonder what that is. It's like a... I don't know. Show some guys the tools working on stuff. Company pictures. Is that all there? Can I just uh, head to the next floor now? Oh, there's a door right here. Or apparently gotta go over there. I didn't notice... hmm. Oh yeah, I guess I went to the door but it didn't open. But I didn't really actually try to go through the door. That wasn't my bad. Hey everybody. This is kind of a creepy room. I hope you're all enjoying yourselves. Wasn't That's weird. Wasn't it fun to learn about Shinra and our esteemed president? And to get a peek at the president's mementos? That was super cool! Yeah, I don't know about all that. Weird. Oh, it's just like showing all the divisions. And the directors of all the divisions. That's kind of cool. I like how his, his is a, like a heart for Urban. Friggin' Heidegger. I'm surprised it doesn't have their names. You'd think it would be. Teach you about the important work we do here by giving you a closer look at each of our divisions. I hope you're ready to be amazed because you simply won't believe all the exciting adventures we have here. These all look so familiar. Cause we've destroyed yeah. a bunch of them already. It's the advanced weaponry. The advanced weaponry exhibit Sky. is currently undergoing maintenance. Oh, that's we guide. apologize for the inconvenience. He's so like Chunk. What? Read 
this? Oh, it's Palmer, not Hedegger. Hedegger's the super gruff guy. To the Shinra building. The Space and Aeronautics Division has taken rocket systems developed for military applications and adapted them to a different purpose. The search for new precious resources in the infinite reaches of space. That being said, well, that being we have plenty said. of Mako at the present. Those plans are currently on hold. It's a bit of a shame, really. I'm looking forward to seeing Sid in part two. Research and development. Is that Hojo I'm guessing? Welcome to Shinra headquarters. My duties as director of research and development are, in all likelihood, far beyond your ability to comprehend. Such an ass. So there will be no presentation, as it would be a waste of my time and yours. But rest assured, we are making great strides. Like I was like, I'm way too smart to talk to you. Because I'm filming this rubbish instead. I love that. I've wasted enough of my precious time as it is. Science waits for no one after all. So, good day. I like how they captured Hojo's character. Extremely pretentious and uh, just so full of himself. The public security exhibit is currently undergoing maintenance. We apologize for the inconvenience. Okay. Oh, this is like the claw that was in the construction area. Okay. Welcome to the Shinra building. Our mission here at Urban Planning. I like how Reeve is very. Uh, oh, that's energy cool looking. Created from Mako. It looks a uh, very Final Fantasy VIII, uh, like gardens. Infrastructure. The pillars that's their like ideal look. The city. What they want to go for. Currently. We are working to construct an intraplate expressway. When this project has been completed, it will provide much easier access to numerous locations all across Midgar. We I do like how it's like a multi-tiered look. In the meantime. Actually, is there anything else that I've ran by? Nah, it just shows the different uh, exhibits. Impressive, wasn't it? I hope you enjoyed learning about our divisions and the wonderful ideas and solutions that are produced to benefit us all. Here at Shinra, we strive to ensure the safety of all residents around the clock. This is kind of cool, not gonna lie. I like how they've got like a... They've really captured like the super modern uh, museum feel. Because I've actually gone to a few museums and aquariums and they have like... Uh, uh, like these electronic displays that like tell stories or like go through a little video that you can watch before you move on. Of course this is obviously, you know, way more high tech yeah, looking, but... I think that's cool. Reactors, as well as the city of Midgar itself. So come on. This is Midgar, our home, recreated in one ten thousandth scale. As you can see here, the eight Mako reactors form a ring around the center of our city and keep Midgar running day and night. Yeah, so for the original game, there was a very similar, um, diorama-like scale thing. But it was, like, broken up into pieces and you had to run around and open treasures to put it back together, uh, and things like that. Thanks to the miracle of Mako energy, our lives are richer and better than ever before. Mako keeps our lives on at night and made Midgar into the city that never sleeps. The triumph of technology and testament to man's potential. Nothing but a bunch of lies. Except that Mako has made people's lives better. Sounds like, I mean, that part's mostly true. It's They're made just... people blind. Blind to the cold hard truth. 
Even I used to buy into their bullshit. Remembering that makes me even mad. It's kind of like geothermal energy if geothermal energy, like, sucked the energy out of the planet as opposed to just, you know, letting it happen naturally. It's like they put a big vacuum hose into the planet and just suck out the energy that's in there. Congratulations! You can call yourself a proud Shinra scholar! Now, moving along, next you'll learn about our progress in advanced science and technology. Please proceed I mean, to the 61st sounds kind of cool. Entertainment hall. Oh, that's, that's so Welcome weird. It's like gated and like forced. An immersive this would be a really cool museum. Please relax and enjoy it's the, the Cosmos show. Theater. Is this going to be very, like, Cosmo Canyon Bugenhagen reminiscent? This place is empty. <laughs> the hell? Oh, hey, our, our gear is back to what the defaults. This must be like a pre rendered cutscene. I was gonna say, I noticed Barrett's gun at first wasn't the normal gun, and then I noticed Cloud's Buster Sword. In the distant past, our planet was home to a people we call the Ancients. Many That's very pretty. Before we discovered Mako, these precursors were already pioneering its use. Somehow they learned of the great reservoir of energy pulsing beneath their feet. That being said, a Final Fantasy and VII like long had, prequel would be pretty cool. The ancients developed the means to harness this bountiful energy and bend it to their will. Like there are prequels and the sequels to the game, but I want to see one that's like in the thousands of, of years ago. Of their scripture too has I think that'd be really cool. We who are born of the planet, with her we speak, her flesh we shape. Unto her I like how it's showing, land, showing some uh, shall we one day return. By her loving grace and providence, may we take our place in paradise. Alas, the ancients themselves are long gone. <sighs> Mostly. 2,000 years ago, a meteor brought an end to their civilization. <laughs> but before their fiery end, yeah. did the ancients find their promised land? Even now, we have only to wonder. Times have changed, and the Shinra Electric Power Company is committed <gasps> to changing and evolving with them. Like this the is ancients, really cool looking. Okay, we've lie. harnessed the power of Mako. <gasps> Are they out there watching us, waiting for us to join them in some blessed corner of the world? A green and verdant land where boundless Mako energy will provide for our every need. Shinra is working for you to fulfill the hope of the ancients and lead us to that promised land. We shall not rest until our dream is realized. This is very interesting. Is this, uh, is this, is this showing medium? Hey, look, it's that guy. No. What I want to know is this: a, is this a cloud freakout moment, or is they are they seeing this on the screen too? This is an incredibly cool shot, though. Sephiroth. 
Oh dear. Oh dear. 69 for A man of my refined taste running out of butter. <laughs> Short of its proper accompaniment, this tea might as well be boiled pond water. <laughs> you put butter in tea? Ooh, interesting. No, it, it couldn't possibly have been. Crazy ass thing made me want to puke. And Very not just because of the presentation, but the content too. Ought to come with a warning. That ain't for kids. That wasn't just a movie. That huge meteor, what was that about? Like I said, nothing you should show a kid. Yeah, I feel like that was like hacked. Very interesting. Congratulations! You can call yourself a proud Shiver expert. Your mission is to go out and tell everyone about the wonders of Shinra. Next, you'll be visiting the repository for Shinra's expertise and know-how. Please make your way to the 62nd floor, the corporate archive. What the? Oh jeez, yeah, it's, it's bugging out. H hello, dude with weird beard? Greetings and welcome, Avalanche, I presume. Uh, hello? My name is Hart, and it's a pleasure to meet you. Who are you, Hart? <laughs> I'm trying to remember if this is... I've come to escort you to Mayor Domino, per his request. The Mayor of Midgar? The empty soup that's just a mouthpiece for Shinra? Yes. The Mayor of our dear Midgar. The most magnificent city ever built. That Mayor Domino. The Visual Entertainment Hall has been experiencing technical difficulties of late, and he suspected that these difficulties might impede your progress. So what does the mayor want with mm. us? I mean, the he, yeah, he's clearly aware that we're here. I'm afraid you'll have to ask him that yourself. In in the original, the mayor literally is just like a guy who's like, yeah, I just, yes, I just chill here, I don't follow. actually do anything. He quizzes you and you get an elemental materia though, so that's cool. At least I think it's elemental, it might be an all materia. I can't remember. I know it's a blue one, though. It has been a while since I've played the original. Yeah, it was in the corporate archives, too. You had to go through and read the books, then he'd give you, like, a little kind of quiz deal. Look at this place. That's a cool Roboto. So what? You telling me the mayor's some kind of crazy bookworm? I like this piano. Very nice. Willow would love this. My wife. She, uh, she's quite the quite the bookworm herself. And this is a really cool library. I like the how it's a radial and like goes up outwards and expands. Ooh, little hidden bookshelf. Through here. If this is a trap, you're a dead man, you hear? This is very cool. There's a chest over there. I'm grabbing that first. You can't stop the me. Mayor is waiting. Okay, you can stop me. Joke's on me. Turns out you can totally stop me. I feel like I should should heal full heal Tifa, but there hasn't been any fights, and I don't think this is going to be a fight. That would be very confusing if it was. This can't be right. Ah, yeah, he's seen everything. Wonderful. You finally made it. <sighs> I am the mayor of the great metropolis of Mako. He's also quite the beard and mustache. <laughs> I must say, you three haven't exactly been discreet. Yeah, no. Huh? I wonder who's been cleaning up all your messes. 
What the hell's going on? Come on, think about it. Yeah, I'm, I'm You've been caught by security several times, walked in front of every other camera, and scared an accountant half to death. Do you hear the alarm? No? You're welcome. <sighs> Which accountant? I can only Is the guy on the train? Wasn't looped in. I am Avalanche's man on the inside. Say what? Interesting. Huh? Is it really that surprising to you? You've seen where they put me. I like this dude. The mayor of the greatest city in the whole wide world, tucked away in a secret broom closet in the damned archives. The nerve. I mean, stupid I think his office is pretty badass. And accept their treatment, but they were wrong, dead wrong. <laughs> dude, this guy's awesome. Well, this ought to make things easier. We need to break into Professor Hojo's lab. What? Why? You mean you're not here to give President Shinra his comeuppance? We're here to save a friend who was taken. But the president's going to get his too, if I have anything to say about it. Mm. Well, I don't particularly I care like what dude. you end up doing, so long <laughs> as it hurts Shinra. He's like, as long as you so, beat up the company that's got me hostage, I'm done with it. Sixty-fourth floor. Hold up. You're telling me that that's the best you can do? That is indeed the best that I can do. But you're the mayor. But you're the mayor? Does this look like the office of a mayor? I'm a glorified librarian, nothing more. They don't even invite me to their meetings. Sorting records and reports, that's all I do. My hands and fingers have more paper cuts than skin. No one knows my pain, my daily torment. <laughs> this they guy. Made me a pathetic shell of a man. Uh, uh, okay, they did you wrong like us, but we'll make it right. So just calm down. Deep breaths, man. Deep breaths. Barrett. <laughs> hmm. Right? Let me see that key card of yours. <laughs> Maybe Diamond might be my favorite NPC now. Plus, he's dapper. I mean, look at this dude. Here My key card has been updated. You can now use it to access the recreational facility on the 63rd floor. And the 64th floor? And then what are we supposed to do? You look for a fellow Avalanche collaborator. Identify yourselves and he'll give you a key card to the 64th. The countersign is... The mayor is the best! <laughs> Midgar's bear is nothing less. Uh, Everyone says he's cooler than the rest. That's, that's so good. They're all, <laughs> I love how they're all just like, eh. Just say mayor to the guy. And if he goes, the best, with gusto, then you found your man. You got it? <laughs> oh, man, I love this guy. If you think you've found the collaborator, say mayor. And see if he says the best. You got it now. All right. Well, uh, <laughs> I think you know what that treasure chest is bothering me. I have to get that first. I was about to end the episode on this note. Um, no, you know this music's nice. I don't want to go through a door and maybe change it. We will leave off this episode with the best NPC, the mayor. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, next episode, we're not going to climb up a bunch of stairs, and we're actually going to maybe go through more of this building. I really like the the tour in the museum. That was a really interesting change. And uh, the whole foreshadowing with Meteor. The This this remake is doing a lot of interesting things, and I want to see what's going to happen. Because the things with the ghosts are new. Uh, Aerith has been kind of hinky at some times, and Cloud has had some like flash-forwards. Uh, which were never in the original game either. And Sephiroth showing up a few times when he hasn't shown up yet. That thing with Palmer was new, but normally in this, uh, in the original, Sephiroth is technically here, and he, uh, Palmer does see him, but you don't actually get that little view, so I like how they expanded on that. But uh, I'm, I'm really interested to in seeing what has been changed, because it seems like the story's gonna go not exactly as the original went. Uh, and I'm really interested to see see what's uh, what's going to be new and different. But uh, we'll experience more of that next episode. I'll leave off with this uh, nice relaxing music. Have a great day, everyone.